side of Smogon and going up against Bert and hoping to stay afloat, really. Um, as it's cool. I never thought I'd say it, but actually facing off against another Waylord, I am totally down. I am totally down with this. And I like to share Nidoking King too because it just makes it more interesting. I do realize that this team lacks Stealth Rocks and that could be. Um, that could be dumb. I was supposed to Nido King's supposed to have it when I kicked off the the new Iron team or lead stuff with Nido King, so that's not great. Question is the way I see it, I have two switch ins. None of them are doing alright. Cause he should go for an ice beam, I think. Yeah, I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Oh, he's scarfed. And I should take this just fine. <laughs> what a nice position to be in. Not do I not only do I have speed right now, but I can actually switch into my iron on his locked in move. He um I'm surprised. I'm <laughs> very surprised. Oh stop, should just go for an ice beam. Goes into Waylord, I think that's fine. Um, some pressure, indeed. Oh, we did alright. I'd be stupid not to bring in Kronk, right? <laughs> Let's go, buddy. Let's pop this guy. That's a tough position to be in, honestly. I have like two turns of this. But the amount of pressure should be real for him. Nidoking, King, Jump Bluff, Waylord. A, a more while if I remember correctly. Which could have intimidated. Or have intimidate. Uh, should probably be his like response to this. Since I don't carry Earthquake. It depends, though, if it is defensive or not. There are a lot of factors there, I think. Ah, my hair. That's fine. That's a good name. Shear Force. That has me less worried, but also means that he has. Shear Force. I don't want to lose my defense as it is. I really like this guy. Oh, it's not pretty. Alright, I have suspected an iron head. <laughs> or play rough. And all of it should hurt so much. Let's see what he got. Play rough. Oh, and oh no. That's the worst. That's the worst. Who misses a play rough anyway? Uh, I swear he's half suspecting me to water spout, but without the tailwind I simply couldn't. Oh, I did outspeed. That's, that's even worse. I did enough. Plus I'm sure he thinks I am locked into that. <laughs> All right. I am like just as excited. <laughs> like, what do I do? What position am I in? Should I continue pressure my opponent? I got a very unfair player of miss. Like, I hate ninety-five percent. It is, it is just the worst. It really is. Right, I can bring an ass off. I'm half expecting sleep powder. It should also be without an item. Oh, low battery. Battery, battery. Soul stance, yeah, that's fair. We know these guys. Uh, um.
I'd sell one of his acrobatics. He must be thinking, I could go for a fucking <laughs> brave bird and neuter him. But he can also just go for sleep powder. And seed bomb plus acrobatics is actually quite alright. More so than I want to give you credit for. But I do like that Crobat actually pose a threat here. And like I said, I shoot out speed. The regular set on this guy though is either strength, sap, or sleep powder. He just decided we draw. Two. Clefunk. Yeah, that's a name. Let's see. Should be able to crush out this or cross poison and hurt him. And then you turn. Of course. I might actually be doing well for all the wrong reasons. Let's see, cross poison is a do like a one third. Oh, it's a two with KO. Stealth rocks, fair enough. He can't take another one of those, I kind of like that. Question is, do I U-turn? I U-turn. He wouldn't sack this, there is no way. Nido King, yeah, it's fine. It's fine. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> I mean, not really. <laughs> and I don't, I should have one more Tailwind left behind me. Could I lock myself into Ice Beam? I think I could. I think I could get away with that. Pressure. Still Tailwind. Ice Beaming. As a pro, as a mad lad, as a boss. I'm pretty sure Scarf Nidoking could outspeed me though. But he doesn't know that. I hope. I mean, he knows that if he's sack plays and I actually don't outspeed. I mean, that's the only way. But then I get the option to see what he locks himself into, which is, uh... There we go. Oh, come on, buddy. Oh, Hank! Yes! <laughs> Eat shit. <laughs> oh, that was phenomenal. And that was my tailwind. Like I said, I... Have expecting it to kind of not work for me. <laughs> oh, Sludge Wave would have killed. Right, Puff Daddy. Here's the thing. In theory, I'm better off ice beaming on his seed bomb. If you sleep powders, then I'm kind of in a good position too. Come on, there is no way of me saving this Waylord, you know that. There we go, nice. Or, I mean, not really, That's, that sucks for me. Uh, <laughs> no, Waylord, no! <laughs> um, and I mean, Kronk should be able to deal with this. You can't get asleep. Acrobatics should hurt, however. But... I don't believe I should be too worried. Who knew I could actually beat a jump bluff? Or, that I actually consider jump bluff a real threat. But it is. 60 base power, you, 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 don't, you don't laugh with that. I mean, base attack. But, yeah. <laughs> you need that soul sense. Had he got the soul sense, though, I... Pretty sure I would have been in trouble. Let's see, his remaining mods. The Clefable, which I beat, and the Burb. Alright, the Swallow. That guy's problem though, that that actually is not a pleasant sight. It depends on the set though. Agron shouldn't be too worried. 
and Crowbar to go speed. The thing is though, Swallow has a move I'm not particularly fond of, which is Reversal. Let's see, Raybird, yeah, fair enough. Let's see, is it Flame Orb? Is it Flame Orb? Ah oh, yeah. Well... Let's go! I think Agron kinda solidifies the game from here. Visage... Still does something. Like that, for me, that's far too much. But yeah. Neuter this guy. <laughs> if you can neuter a bird, can you? I mean, in theory, I guess you can. <laughs> but yeah! Hell! I actually managed to make this work. Crobat was an absolute mad player. And a little bit of luck with the play rough, and I mean, here we go. I feel a little bit bad for my opponent, I honestly do. But it took me six games to score a win with this team. I'm just telling you guys, this is the first win. That's not, uh, that's not too impressive, it really isn't. But that's it guys, as always, thanks for watching, hope you enjoyed this game. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care, I want to write. Bye.